A full house to discuss the fate of four Memphis Shelby County schools. Hello, I'm Greg Hurst. Hi, I'm Stephanie Skurlock. The meeting comes as the deadline approaches to make a decision regarding the controversial 3G bill involving three schools in Germantown. WREG's Bria Jones joins us live outside district headquarters with reaction from students and parents tonight. Bria? Well, Greg and Stephanie, the district says tonight's meeting was all about informing families with dozens of parents and students showing up to let their voices be heard. There was standing room only at Monday's Memphis Shelby County Schools community meeting in Cordova to discuss options moving forward with students and staff at Germantown Elementary, Middle and High Schools, along with Lucy Elementary in Millington. The conversation coming after Tennessee lawmakers passed a new bill that prohibits MSCS from operating schools within the boundaries of another district starting July 1st of next year, unless there is a written agreement between the two districts. The law could change things for students like eight-year-old Francis Snell, a third grader at Germantown Elementary, who would be zoned for a different school. I like my friends, I like my teachers, and I feel like I'm a lot smarter than Her father, a Germantown High teacher, was among the concerned parents in the crowd. I feel like the stability of our children should be our number one concern, and her being stolen away from her friends and her awesome teachers. That's, that's devastating. Tonight, the district discussed options for the 4,000 students who are being impacted. The board said it's exploring options to maintain the buildings, seek funding for new schools, and potentially busing students to other MSCS campuses. Our parents have said they desire and deserve to keep our athletic teams together, to keep our staff together, to keep our students together. With no shortage of school pride in the building, students let it be known with their voices and signs they want to save the G. Saving that, it doesn't mean just save the building, save the three schools. It means save the people. And we're all together in this, so it's like you save one person, you save everybody else. Now, if no agreement is reached, MSCS would be required to transfer ownership of the buildings. Some believe if that happens, those schools will be torn down and the students will be sent elsewhere. We did reach out to Germantown schools for comment this afternoon, but have yet to hear back. For now, reporting live in Midtown, Bria Jones, WREG News, Channel 3.